This video will explain how to start using Nightwatch and how the system works. Nightwatch detects nighttime epileptic seizures and warns family members or care professionals when possible dangerous seizures are taking place. Nightwatch is supplied in this travel case and the set contains the following items. The wireless arm module for taking measurements during sleep. The base station, which sends an alert of a possible seizure. Elastic band with four clips. Black adapter for mains electricity for the base station. White charger plus USB-C cable for the arm module. Instructions. Alert card. Adjusting the elastic band. First, cut the elastic band to size. Place the band around the wearer's upper arm, biceps, and mark the position where the band overlaps. Next, cut the band using scissors. You should have a small bag containing four clips. Two of these clips are needed to attach the band to the Nightwatch arm module. Make sure the protruding part of the clip faces upwards and push the band through both clips. Allow for a small piece of extra material. Then snap the clips onto the white side of the arm module, making sure that the black side of the band is on the inside. To check that the armband fits properly, wear the arm module on the front of the upper arm around the biceps directly on the skin. Any clothing, such as pyjamas, should be worn over the arm module. The band should be a snug fit, not too tight and not too loose. It should not move down and you should be able to fit one finger between the elastic band and the skin. Adjust the band by pulling the material. Use scissors to remove any excess material on the inside of the arm module. It is important that the band does not cover the two green lights. Use a pointy object, such as a pen, to switch on the arm module, using the switch on the dark-coloured side of the arm module. Two green LED lights should now be visible. These lights are part of the heartbeat sensor. It may be that one of the green LED lights switches off after a while. This is normal. Charging the arm module The arm module has to be charged before use. Connect the white charger and white USB cable to the arm module and plug the charger into a socket. The green LED lights will switch off when the arm module is connected to the charger during the day. Please make sure the arm module is switched on during charging. The arm module must be switched on at all times, unless the device is being moved from one location to another. The base station. Remove the base station and the black adapter from the travel case. Connect the adapter and plug it into a socket. The base station will start up. This will take around 30 seconds. Every light on the base station will briefly light up. As soon as one or two orange lights and two green lights are visible, the system has completed its startup. Now set the desired alert volume using the two buttons on top of the base station. One button increases the volume and the other button lowers the volume. When you press the buttons, you will hear a ringing alarm sound that is also heard if a possible epileptic seizure is detected. Place the base station in a position where the alerts for a possible seizure can be heard. The distance between the base station and the arm module should not be more than 15 meters. The base station will sound an alert if the alarm module is or will be out of range. Contact us if you require a range of more than 15 meters. As soon as the base station has started up and the arm module is switched on and charged, Nightwatch is ready for use. Using Nightwatch The best time to put on Nightwatch is when the wearer goes to bed. Remove the arm module from the charger. When detaching the charger, you will hear a beep every two seconds and see a blinking red light on the base station. This means that the arm module and the base station are connected, but that no heartbeat has been detected yet. Place the arm module around the upper arm. Nightwatch will detect a heartbeat after a short while and the beeping will stop. In addition, the red light on the base station should be off and a green light should be visible. 
This means Nightwatch is working correctly and the wearer can go to sleep. The arm module will also show that a heartbeat has been detected. A green light will be visible on the white side of the arm module. The brightness of this light is intended for use at night and therefore will only be visible properly in dark surroundings. Nightwatch recognises whether the wearer is still sitting in an upright position, walking around or resting in bed and will adjust its sensitivity accordingly. Once the wearer has been at rest for a while, the lights on the base station and the white side of the arm module will light up continuously. This means Nightwatch is measuring at its highest sensitivity. Nightwatch measures the heartbeat and movements of the wearer continuously throughout the night and uses this information to detect whether the wearer is having a possible dangerous epileptic seizure. In the event of a possible seizure, the base station will sound a ringing alert and a red light will start to blink on the base station as well as the arm module. Pressing one of the volume buttons while the alert is ongoing will temporarily pause the sound. The alert will be sounded for three minutes, after which Nightwatch resets to the normal setting and is ready to sound the alert for another seizure. There is no need to do anything. This is an automatic process. Nightwatch will also sound an alert if potential good measurements cannot be taken during the night. The base station uses beeps and light signals to signal the issue. Not possible to measure reliable heartbeat. One beep every two seconds. Not possible to connect to arm module. Two beeps per two seconds. The arm module battery is low. Four beeps per two seconds. All notifications and their explanations can be found quickly and easily on the alert card included. Carefully read the instructions before use. Nightwatch detects epileptic seizures as accurately as possible, but it could possibly miss potential seizures. In addition, Nightwatch might sound an alert even when no epileptic seizure is taking place. If this happens regularly, please contact us. Often, it only takes a few minor hints and tips to find a resolution. Please follow the instructions before use and make sure Nightwatch is suitable. If you have any questions about using Nightwatch, please contact our help desk or visit our website. Our website also offers additional information on other features of Nightwatch, such as the use of Nightwatch Data Portal, which can be used to view the Nightwatch measurement data. Nightwatch, a safer night for people with severe epilepsy.